So today I'm going to talk about Google Hangout Meet and uh, that's the one which is a video conferencing application for Google and the new name that Google has given is Google Meet. So that's not the only change Google has done. So what Google has done is something more. So if you want to hear about that, please stick with me uh, with this video because I'm going to show you something that's really going to be really informative. So open Google and in Google you can type Google Hangout Meet app. So enter that. So the first uh, search that comes up, click on that. That is the Google Hangout Meet. So click on that. And once you click on that, uh, this page pops up. And here you would see that it says with a message here, it, it says with a broadcast message that all G Suite uh, customers they can avail the advanced hangout meet features including larger meetings live streaming and recording for free and that's for free so basically what is saying is that if you have a G Suite uh, account then you can avail the hangout features free of cost and that's a very big uh, I would say feature that Google is actually opening and this feature they are opening if you click on learn more you would see here that it says that it, it is uh, helping businesses and schools to stay connected in response to coronavirus so if you come a little bit down you would see here that it says that it has extended the use the free access to the hangout meet video conferencing capabilities for all the G Suite uh, you know you can say users till the September 30th 2020 now that's what I call Google you know so Google has actually you know been very proactive because you know the security you know glitches that we have seen with zoom so uh, in case you have not watched the video that I have already created uh, for zoom security which you shouldn't be using and the reasons why you shouldn't be using please uh, check the cards which are there uh, somewhere uh, on the screen right now uh, because that's a video where I have detailed out why you know zoom should not be used and uh, here I'm going to say that you know uh, I mean my next option uh, for uh, after zoom was actually teams you know Microsoft teams but then when Google came out with this particular uh, you know information and news I mean I can say guarantee that you know this is uh, the security that anyone can actually get I mean there is no better security than Google you know so uh, if you are a educator or you know if you are a business uh, person uh, so anybody uh, be it anyone you know if you're an IT guy so uh, you can actually avail the different options that Google is right now giving so if you click on uh, like say G Suite or let me go to the hangout meet here so you would see here that it says that it is trusted by enterprises across the world and it is very very easy to use uh, so I have used this in the past uh, the Google Hangout and it's really uh, very you know easy to use I mean there couldn't be anything easier than the Google Hangout you know uh, so it's basically seamless uh, you know meetings that you can actually have you know so you can see here that is designed for businesses uh, you can do recordings uh, you can add as many participants as you want and uh, just as you uh, would want you know the encryption is solid so there is no way anyone can actually breach into your meetings you know like they could do for zoom if you are still here in this video please uh, you know subscribe definitely give me a like okay because i deserve that because i'm giving you this very very big news that google has come out with so and also you know comment below that you know you feel that you know google has actually now been a game changer and it is actually serving us with a very very big feature 
so uh, you can actually you know uh, join the meetings also on the go so for example you can join on your iPhone on your Android or if you are you know driving in car and you know like if you're not driving you know actually so uh, you can actually join through your laptop you know anything you know so uh, you can actually do that and uh, it works with other uh, solutions as well so what it says is you know if you have Skype uh, and you want uh, somebody is joining through Skype and uh, a few of your members are joining through Hangout it, it definitely can you know it, it definitely has that capability of joining uh, uh, through that as well so uh, let me come back here and I would like to show you here that it says that larger meeting up to 250 participants per call live streaming is possible for 100,000 viewers within a particular domain and uh, just be aware like for this you would need a G Suite so that is something uh, that is very essential but to join a, a, a you know, Google meet a meeting is not that uh, you know difficult because all you have to do here is you know let me close this let me open so what you type in the address bar is meet.google.com and then press enter and it will take you to this kind of a page so what it says here is that uh, for me uh, as I am recording this on the 10th of April uh, it says the time here and it says that uh, my account only lets me to join the meetings the reason is because uh, I am not using the G Suite right now I was using it some time back but I am not required to because I as I said you know, I was using Teams, so I don't need the I was not needing the hangout but uh, definitely I will go ahead and actually have a G Suite account uh, soon you know signed up so uh, right now what you need to do is you need to click on this use a meeting code so if you click on this it would say that enter the meeting ID so if your friend is actually you know uh, setting up a meeting in Google meet so uh, you would get a particular meeting ID in your email so you can take that uh, you know meeting ID and you can just put it here and you can continue and then you would be taken to uh, the screen where you can directly enter the meeting okay so I cannot show you right now uh, but that's it's very simple It's just one click away from there it's not very very difficult you know it's very very easy to use so once you join that meeting uh, you can mute any particular you know user you want uh, you can keep yourself on mute also you know that's one of the features that is there because if there are multiple people and there are some background noises you would need to you know mute that specific uh, users uh, you know or uh, participants you can say participants uh, uh, mic right so you can do that as the capability you can have the chat feature so you can chat there so there are a lot of different other features also okay if you click on get help uh, from the hangouts page it will take you to the page wherein it shows you uh, it gives you the training and it shows you like what all things you need to do so before you start off uh, the, the preparation that you need to have so you can check your requirements for Google meet uh, so if you click there for example it would say that for Google meet uh, you would need uh, to create a video meeting so that is what is very important to create a video meeting you would need to have a signed in G Suite account okay but to join this you just need the meet app as I said so the meet app uh, this particular thing you can have it downloaded on your Android or on your iOS or you can also have it on your laptop so that's how you want to use it so uh, the next thing uh, is like if I go back uh, you, you prepared for the Google meet now uh, you know what you need to do is you can start a video meeting so and then you can join a video meeting and then you can add people to the meeting so you can directly add people also 
uh, in the meeting so there are different ways of adding such as you know you have it in your google calendar uh, so you can uh, directly you know have those people added from there or you can in, you can send an invite to them as i showed you in the previous uh, you know screen wherein you just put up uh, you know invite id or you can use meet or you can also have dial you can also uh, you know have people join uh, with the phone so you can just dial from the google uh, hangout you can just add people that you want so you want to add your like say friend or your business uh, you know uh, associate you know so you can just give him a call there if the call would go to his phone and then you can directly add there you know so that's a very very cool feature uh, uh, that is there uh, after that you know the, the level 2 is uh, collaboration in the video meeting so that is also very important wherein as I was saying you know you can pin or you can you can mute uh, a particular participant uh, that is there uh, you can have screen layouts also there in the meeting so uh, that's very important if you are giving any presentation so that's uh, something that is very important and uh, you know uh, you can also use a phone for audio in a video meeting uh, and uh, not only that you know you can also share resources also and that is also something that is very very important and this is very very secured so you can you can send something uh, some files or something you know some voice uh, you know recordings uh, through your chat uh, or you can send some attachments so uh, you can do basically anything right and the person who is the host or something you know he can also record or any other participant can also record the meeting uh, and uh, definitely you know this can go live so uh, that's all i just wanted to bring up in this particular you know a uh, quick video uh, because this is something that is going to be a big big game changer so if you're still with me, uh, please comment below if this video was really, you know, useful for you guys. Uh, if yes, then please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye-bye.